From the launch of the iPhone X, Apple has stretched the Touch ID and adopted the Face ID technology. This move has allowed Apple to increase the usable screen area and by introducing the revolutionary notch and the Face ID, they mark the beginning of a new era of facial recognition. But since then, a lot has changed. Right now, we have in-display technology in Android smartphones which allows it to use maximum screen space than any other technology and thereby making the iPhone's notch design completely obsolete. I'm sure the Apple fans were hoping that the iPhone will bring a notchless design this year, but that didn't happen. But it seems the Apple is already working on it and we can expect a notchless iPhone with in-display fingerprint scanner next year. Anonymous tipster Love to Dream, who has a good track record of accurate leaks, has revealed Apple is indeed working on an underscreen touch ID system. This new information is in perfectly sync with the leaks from the popular leakster Min Chi Ko back from August 2019. He also suggested that Apple is working on an in-display touch ID system and would probably debut in high-end iPhone 13 Pro. He also suggested that Apple is working on a modified version of Qualcomm's ultrasonic in-display fingerprint scan technology but would give emphasis on the power conception, increasing sensing area size and reducing the thickness of the module, while he was very confident that Apple would achieve everything by 2021. Another aspect in which Apple is currently lagging behind the Android is the high refresh rate display. As we know, all the flagship devices from Android now have 120Hz display and there were rumors that iPhone 12 Pro would feature 120Hz display but that was not actually implemented because of the battery backup concern. Well, it seems Apple is all set to fill that gap too. According to the latest info, the Apple will bring the 120Hz display panels to the iPhone 13 Pro variants and that also with LTPO technology which means the iPhone 13 Pro variants would be capable of automatically adjusting the refresh rate depending on the content being shown and therefore decreasing the power consumption. Realistically, this would mean that when operating in blank screen, the display could reduce its refresh rate as low as 1Hz. At the same time, it can go up to 120Hz while gaming. So after all these leaks, it seems the next year's iPhone 13 Pro series would probably be the best iPhone ever by which the Apple could fill the technology gap between the current Android and iPhone in the market, along with the upgrades in camera, chipset and a much needed boost in the battery capacity. So guys, that's pretty much that we have here in this video. If you found this video informative, hit the like button, share with your friends and stay subscribed for more.